how to install models in focus ai hello everyone welcome back to the channel in this video i will show you how you can easily install models ai in focus so make sure you watch the video carefully until the very end so in the first step we need to have a website from where we could download the models for that you can use this website called civit ai so you need to open your web browser and in the search bar you simply need to type civitai.com and then you will be landed on the official website of civit ai now over here you are going to see various tabs like home models image videos etc so as you want to get the models over here you will have to click on the models tab in order to save time and here it will by default set on all so if it is on all it will show you all of the characters and objects so you just have to select the image from here or what you can do is you can simply use some of the filters so in order to add filters on top of it you will have to hover over to the top right hand corner and click on the filters tab here you will be able to see this base model section so for focus ai you need to choose the sd excel model so you will have to choose them and then you just have to come back now it will show you all of the models with sd excel so you just have to now choose your model if you click on any of the images then if you scroll down for that image you are going to see a gallery of images that are generated by using that model so before downloading any of the models from here you need to make sure that you read the descriptions because sometimes you are going to get some of the prompts or negative prompts or some of the best settings relating to the model that you have selected so now once you have chosen the model if you want to download it from here then you will have to click on the download button now after downloading it you just have to add them into the focus folder now if you are using the downloaded version of focus then you must have the focus folder so you just have to launch that and there you just have to add the model folder uh, you can use this path focus slash model slash checkpoints if you are using the google collab then what you can do is you can simply use this code i will put the link of it down in the description box as well so you can use this code so over here instead of this model name you just have to provide the name of the model for that you will have to come to this page here it is the name of the model so you just have to copy the name from of the model from here then go back to this code after that you just have to paste the name over here then in the model link so in order to find the model link you will have to click on this share button in the top and then click on copy url now come back to this code now instead of this model link you just have to paste the code now you just have to copy the whole code from here and you just have to open the new tab in your web browser this time you will have to type focus collab after that you are going to see the first link of focus collab here so you will have to click on it and then you will be redirect on this focus page now over here you just have to hover over to this section where you are going to see these two tabs of code and text so you will have to first click on code then you will have to paste the code that we have just copied now after pasting the code you just have to scroll down again and you will have to click on the code button then you just have to scroll up and you are going to see this python code so you need to copy it from here then come back and you just have to paste it over here now between the actual script and this last line you can add as many models as you want after adding them you will have to run the first file now once the first file runs successfully you will have to run the second file after that you will have to run the third file it actually depends on your internet connection so you just have to wait for some time if it is delaying in installing so once it is installed successfully if you want to view it then you will have to click on this files tab over here and it will show you all of the folders that are installed in focus including the models tab as well so as you can see that this is the models folder it is showing over here now before doing anything over here you need to make sure that you click on cannot save changes and after that you will have to click on save a copy in drive or you just have to hover over to files and click on it and then you will have to click on save a copy in drive then you just have to start running these files and once these files are running successfully 
you just have to click on the public url so in this code you are going to see the running on public url so you simply need to click on this url and it will redirect you on focus now over here in order to access the settings you will have to click on the advanced tab over here and then if you click on the model tab it will show you the model that we have selected over here now when you are using any of the models in focus ai you need to make sure that these styles are selected unchecked so make sure that you are not using any of these styles over here after that you just have to start generating the prompts by using the model that you have selected now if you want to view the history of all of the models that you have selected so you will have to hover over in the right hand side and click on the history log here you will be able to see all of the images that you have generated previously now if you want to copy any of these then you just have to click on copy to clipboard and you can use these presets uh, for the future generations as well so with the help of Civit AI, you can basically download the models and with the help of Focus Collab, you can add them into the folder. And once it is finished successfully, uh, you will notice that the model is added successfully. Now you can use that model and start generating the images by providing the prompts in this section and clicking on the generate button. So this is how you can easily install models in Focus AI. I hope the video was helpful and if it was then don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much for watching.